Welcome back. Doctors say that a potentially dangerous virus is creeping up again in San Antonio. We're talking about a common respiratory virus known as RSV. The thing is, the CDC also says there's a vaccine shortage for that virus. But as the night team's Avery Everett explains, doctors say that there are still options to protect those that are considered high risk. She declined so fast over the last week. Like I wasn't prepared for her to get so sick so quickly. Nine month old Isabel Perez battled a virus that was severe enough to put her in the hospital. She went from being like super happy and bubbly and smiley to not wanting to do anything but be held and sleep. Her mother says Isabel was diagnosed with respiratory syncytial virus or RSV. It is a sickness that doctors say first comes across with mild or cold like symptoms. But for those at risk, it could cause serious harm. And it's really fast. That concern among families is growing as San Antonio's RSV case count continues to tick up. But doctors here in San Antonio say even as the CDC issued a health alert warning about some potential shortages when it comes to RSV vaccines, there are still ways to stay safe in San Antonio. Hand washing is very important. Older adults and younger children under the age of one are the most at risk for complications. This past week, actually, we had an increase of about 63% on our hospital's virology report. But this year, doctors say they have more options to fight the virus compared to years past. Two different vaccines, and there's also a long-acting monoclonal antibody. Doctors say the antibody is most likely to be in short supply. And the manufacturer hasn't had enough time to meet the demand. For families like that of baby Isabel, getting through this season has already been a struggle. She's starting to like laugh again, which was really rough because for a couple days we didn't see that. Now out of the hospital and breathing again on her own, Isabel's family is holding on to hope. Avery Everett, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.